Hello everyone. A high proportion of deaths classified as euthanasia in Belgium have involved patients who have not requested that a, do a doctor ends their lives, a new study has found. Researchers have discovered that seriously ill or elderly patients taken to hospital are often given lethal doses of drugs to end their lives even though they have not asked to be killed. This practice is against the law in Belgium. Critics say, however, that it is barely distinguishable from murder. Voluntary euthanasia, where patients request that a doctor ends their lives, has been permitted in Belgium for the last 16 years. It is found that a fifth of nurses interviewed by researchers admitted that they had been involved in the euthanasia of a patient. However, what is quite worrying is that nearly half of these nurses, 120 out of 248, also admitted that they had taken part in termination of the patients' lives without their request or consent. Now that is murder. Dr. Peter Saunders, director of the Care Not Killing Alliance, an umbrella group of more than 50 British medical charities opposed to euthanasia, said... Once you legalise any form of euthanasia, you inevitably get people pushing the boundaries. Once you have legalised voluntary euthanasia, involuntary euthanasia will follow. It appears that around half of the euthanasia cases are occurring outside the law in Belgium without the request of the patient. This has shaken people's trust in nurses because they've been traditionally viewed as the patient's advocate and not someone who might be part of the decision to end their lives without their explicit consent. The rationale behind this euthanasia way of thinking is that killing is an acceptable answer to human suffering. So when doctors and nurses allow involuntary euthanasia, they assume they are doing the best for the patient by cutting short their lives. Now this is a sorry state of affairs, and far removed from the Christian ideal of care for the most vulnerable in our society. Thank you all for listening, and God bless you all. Oh.